ஹலோ எவ்ரி ஒன் அது சிறு பிரசாந்த் தான் வெல்கம் டு பைத்தன் ஆட்டோமிக் செல்லியம் சீரீஸ் டுடே வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு சி த செல்லியம் லொக்கேட்டர்ஸ் இன் எக்ஸ்பாத் ஸோ எக்ஸ்பாத் இஸ் த மெயின் திங் ஆஃப் செல்லியம் ஸோ ஸோ வாட் இஸ் எக்ஸ்பாத் ஸோ எக்ஸ்பாத் இஸ் ஒன் ஆஃப் அ லொக்கேட்டர் இஃப் யூ வாண்ட் டு நோ த பேசிக் ஆஃப் லொக்கேட்டர்ஸ் கோ அண்ட் சி த ப்ரீவியஸ் வீடியோ ஸோ ரைட் நோ வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு சி த எக்ஸ்பாத் ஸோ எக்ஸ்பாத் வி ஹவ் அ ரிலேட்டிவ் பாத் தட் இஸ் த மோஸ்ட்லி யூஸ்ட் இன் இண்டஸ்ட்ரி ஸோ ஃபார் எக்ஸ்பாத் திஸ் இஸ் அ பேசிக் சின்டெக்ஸ் ஸோ டபுள் ஸ்லாஷ் இஸ் அ டேக் நேம் ஸ்கொயர் ப்ராக்கெட் அட் ஆட்ரிபியூட் equal to attribute value so if you want to know what is tag name what is attribute see the previous video let's i will show in a real time as well if you take this uh, website so this is a registration website so i will give you the url in the description so if you want to type anything in uh, first name so right click as usual click on a inspect if you see the inspect this is the inspect uh, like code input it have a type place holder class those things if you see it don't have a id it don't have a, a, a name anything because uh, mostly id is a unique so class is not a unique mostly because it has so many values it's not a unique so how to this kind of places xpath will help us okay so to write some, we need to use a control f or if you are using mac command f so if you open it it will open this thing so in this place only we can write our own xpath and validate it okay so come to our syntax what is our syntax i need to double slash so i need to use double slash next i want to say tag name so what is the tag name of our code import this input is our tag name so i'm copying the input okay and square bracket okay next thing is we need to we need to give the attribute so what are the attribute this input has it have a type it have a place holder it have a class and it have a ng model okay so we can take a place holder so i'm copying the place holder in the square bracket i am giving at symbol and place holder equal to in a single quotation what is the place holder value so never type <coughs> it always copy and paste it copy the first name so and paste it see this it was highlighted in the yellow color and never forget to see here one on one so this is a one on one that means it's a unique xpath okay so this is how we need to take a simple xpath okay so in the same like we can use a star also suppose you don't have a, don't want to reveal the tag name means we can use star as well see this i'm using star that means anything any tag so here also now also my xpath this unique is one of one okay so this is another way of finding the general xpath okay if you inspect this first name see this full name so this full name is a text so if you want to find this location of this full name so i want to use copy the full name i want to use which tag this is a label tag so see this is a label tag so i will use label equal to text so text is the method in the method i am going to give the value what is the value full name see this it is exactly highlighted in yellow color and my xpath is one of one that means unique xpath okay so this uh, we need to use a text method so whatever the black color text okay wherever the black color is there i i told you in previous session also we called as a text so this is the full name is a text here in a black color okay then what is the contains use suppose in the same full name so i don't want to give the star i only want to give the full name so how do i give it so in this method i need to provide the contains method and text inside text method and i want to pass the value of it so so this is the use of contains method so in contains method we don't need to use the full full like i don't need to give anything so only i can the text is which value i want to give it's like contains okay so this is the difference between in interview also i will ask you what is the difference between text and contains Te- text i going to give full value in contains i need to give a partial value sana so that is the difference between text method and contain method then is index suppose you are taking uh, i'm taking label okay see this there is a 19 label if i want to go to particular label i want to give a index see this if i give one it's going to the first index if i in a square bracket i will give it two it's go to the another index see this so this is the index value in a square bracket we study in array or list as well so we need to use a square bracket to indicate which which indi- index i want to go okay 
next one is rr logic or and logic suppose you have a two condition so anyone want to pass or anyone both need to pass so that kind of places we can use it okay example so in a same i will come to our previous example in the first name field itself i am having already i have the what one placeholder x path okay I have expert. So I want a second condition. So second condition is I'm using R in a middle. Second condition is this ng module also want to have what the same. See this still one of one. So both the condition need to be given. So okay. So if I'm using, I'm removing one small a, but I didn't fail because in R condition anyone want to pass. Suppose I'm uh, I'm making R to and see this. right now i'm not getting any exception because there is a error so both the condition need to pass okay then only it will give the value okay in a and condition so this is a logical of and and or so so if you want to use both the things want to pass means you want to on either one want to pass means you can use or in a middle okay so we need to use the or operator is like a logical operator and the next thing is parent child things suppose you identify the root suppose you identify the form so see here the form as a id so i'm creating one new expa double slash form and at id equal to see this so i identify the form so the form has couple of child like this div this div So it has so many. How many childs? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's almost fifteen childs. So how do I identify double slash child? So I want to know how many child. See this. Under this there are thirty seven child. So if you use a single bracket, now it will give a all the direct child. Okay, my direct child is. I want to give a single bracket slash for multi child double. See this. Using a child child method, we can able to get all the child methods under the parent suppose you are in a form as in the like a parent for this form as one div as a parent so i want to know who is my uh, parent means i want to change to parent see this this is my div is my parent see so it's one of one so i am able to identify the parent from the child previous method is from child to parent suppose i want to know my ancestor that means like grand grandparent means i want to use ancestor method see this i have three ancestor three divs 1 2 3 above me so that's why to identify the grandparents we can use ancestor method okay next one is following sibling and preceding siblings suppose in interview i will ask you you are in a this div right now you are in a cricket check box in the cricket there is a input there is a label so you are able to identify the label like see this input so i am writing double slash input input square bracket at id equal to what check box 1 suppose you want to go to the label so who is a label label is your sibling because we are the same our same parent okay so how to go to him double slash following hyphen sibling double colon you know what is his name label see here from me i am able to label is highlighting so it's a one of one so this is how we need to you going to the what following sibling so so like your next child like younger brother kind of suppose you are in label think like that you are in label how do we can go to the your uh, uh, like your elder brother so at that time you need to use the preceding siblings okay so this method will go like to the your elder brothers following sibling will go to the younger brothers okay so these are the expats types you can uh, explore it uh, if you have any doubts please put me in the comment i will uh, i will clarify those things if you like the video please subscribe and share to your friend